Yeah, hello. So here I want to show you how to cut out an image with GIMP and also how to add transparency to it. Okay, so here I have this example image and I'm going to start out with adding the transparency to it. And I do that by going into the menu bar here under layer and then transparency and here you will see add alpha channel. So in case this is grayed out, then you already have transparency or the alpha channel enabled. Okay, then let's go to how to cut out an image. You have three tools to do that here in this toolbox. First, you have here the rectangle and then the oval or a circle. And as a third tool, you have here this lasso. And I want to cut out here in this example, this mountain so i'm going to use this lasso tool in this case because it's so oddly shaped the mountain that is and i do that by just clicking on one side of the mountain here and then i create this path by just keeping on clicking further along the edge of the mountain but then there's also a different way on how you can do that and that is by just pressing and holding the mouse button and then you just follow the path of what you want to cut out. See, like I'm doing here, I'm just going to follow the mountain range here all the way on the top. And I keep holding the mouse button at all times until I'm here on the far right end. And this is where I let go. And now I have this whole area covered. And then I'm adding another dot here in the lower right corner, one in the lower left. Now to close the loop, I'm just going to select the first dot here that I created. So when I click that, then this mountain here is now selected. So, but actually the mountain is the piece, the part of the picture that we want to keep. So I'm going here to right click and I go under select and I invert my selection. That means as soon as I do that, now the sky or whatever is left over of the image is going to be selected. Just like this. And now we want to get rid of that. And how do we, how do we get rid of the sky here? And that is pretty easy. You just also right click and you do edit. And now you say cut. And that means you're going to cut out the entire selection, which is here the mountain or the sky behind the mountain. And now you see here this checkered area. This is all transparent. So we have now our transparency that we want in this image. And now we can save this. And if you want to publish your picture here or use it for something else, and maybe you want to export this here to a different format. And I'm suggesting here to use the PNG format or you can alternatively also use GIF. Uh, GIF is not loss lossless, so I'm going to use PNG to uh, keep my uh, quality of the image here. So I'm going to save this here under PNG. Okay, and then as soon as this is saved, we can just check in like an image viewer if this is really transparent. You see, there it is, the PNG, and let's open that up with the preview. And you can see here with the gray background, that means here the sky is gone. And there's also, it's not white, there's no white background, it's literally no background. It's transparent, just as we wanted it. Yeah, okay, so I hope this video was helpful. And if you have any questions, then uh, leave a comment below. And don't forget to check out my other GIMP tutorial videos.